Would you trust the men and women in blue to bring your loved ones home? How far would you go if it was your child on the line? What if they were only a baby? In this video are real life stories of police officers racing against the clock, battling crazy suspects to rescue the innocent. Will they make it in time? Number one, kidnapped baby allegedly used this human shield. This video follows the events that unfolded on September 27 in Flagler County, Florida. The story revolves around a dramatic incident involving a 27-year-old man named Brandon Lee Lenner, who hails from Palm Coast. It all began when Lenner allegedly abducted his girlfriend's one-year-old son while armed with a handgun. Then he drove recklessly with the baby boy in his lap, evading the authorities. Show me your fucking hands, dude! Put the baby down! Put the kid down! Put the kid down! Put the kid down, dude! Put the kid down! The body camera footage from police officers' perspective captures the intense moments that followed. As the officers cornered Leonard near a McDonald's drive thru he resorted to desperate measures to avoid arrest, holding the baby in front of himself as a human shield. Despite the tasing he received, Leonard managed to get back on his feet and attempted to flee. The officers quickly gave chase and finally apprehended him, ending the dangerous and harrowing ordeal. Take this, take this. <laughs> Stop resisting! Stop resisting! You're getting tamed! Tango! 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 Thankfully, the one-year-old boy wasn't injured during this incident. Brandon Lee Leonard now faces charges of kidnapping and using a minor as a human shield, and justice will be served in the aftermath of this alarming event. The next video shows a woman chained to the floor of a storage container. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insane videos like this. Number 2. Police Free Woman Kidnapped by Serial Killer In a chilling and shocking incident in South Carolina, Police rescued a 30-year-old woman named Kayla Brown, who had been kidnapped by a serial killer. The Spartanburg County Sheriff revealed that Kayla Brown was found chained up like a dog inside a storage container in November, where she'd been held captive for two months. Just a girl, just a girl. How are you? Bolt cutters. This is our best friend. He's a paramedic. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're going to get you out of there, okay? Just hang loose for me. Anybody got a, I need a hand? The rescue occurred after police heard screams coming from the container, located on the property of 45 year old Todd Colehead, a local real estate agent. As the officers freed her, she bravely recounted the horror she had endured, including witnessing Todd Colehead shoot her boyfriend, Charlie Carver three times in the chest and abdomen before disposing of his body. Todd Colehep shot Charlie Carver three times in the chest, heart, put him in the bucket of the tractor, locked me down here and I never seen him again. Tragically, authorities also discovered the bodies of two other people on the property, including Kayla's boyfriend, Charlie Carver. Todd Colehep, the perpetrator, has reportedly confessed to a total of seven murders, including a quadruple murder at a motorcycle shop in 2003. As part of his plea agreement, he avoided the death penalty, but was sentenced to life in prison for his heinous crimes, which include forcing himself on Kayla Brown. Here's another video where police officers successfully track down a kidnapper and rescue an innocent woman. What do you think of the video? Let me know in the comments section. Number three. Police body cam video shows rescue of kidnapped woman. On January 30th, 2021, body cam footage showed a tense situation as police attempted to rescue a kidnapped woman. The officers successfully pulled over the car and immediately ordered the suspect and passenger to come out. Hey, 
Hands up! Hands up, passenger! Get on the ground, passenger! All the way! Stop! Get on your knees! Keep your hands up! Put your hands behind your head and your your fingers. Got it. I got him. Vehicle clear. Where's the key at? Where's the key at? The police apprehended the suspect, ensuring the safety of the kidnapped woman who was inside of the car. Got a camera. Do you need a. Oh yeah. my god, thank you. I got throwing. Okay, okay we're gonna get you out of here, okay? Bit. We're gonna get you out of here. Do you need me to say anything about what happened or anything? Sarge, I'm gonna take some pictures. We have the evidence she's tight chained down by the neck. While the officers took the chains off the woman, she was visibly scared and was crying following the horrific experience she had to face. Got another hand, okay? Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. He had me earlier and I got him to take him off. Okay, hold this one. Got it. Here, you got one. Sarge, I don't got a key for the next one. The body cam footage showcased the officer's swift actions and dedication to rescuing the kidnapped woman. He fucking hauled ass. Yeah, he's, he's my ex-boyfriend. How did you know who did? I was up at the office trying to run him, see if we had anything on him. He dragged me out of the place and I fought so fucking hard because I was like, this is how you die. I think a neighbor saw me getting dragged out. Mm -hmm. He choked me out like six times. Okay, did you lose consciousness when he was choking you? Yes, like six. He choked me out. That's all I was just going to see if that's all right with you guys. I don't know. I don't know whose it is, so. We have an ambulance on the way to check you out, okay? <laughs> You guys need my, my information? Yeah, I do. Um, oh, but you're from Nevada? Uh, Las Vegas. Las Vegas, Nevada? Nevada, yeah. Nevada. <coughs> What's your first name? Jane. Oh, name Jane. Last name? Preby. <laughs> okay, you want to have a seat in here, warm up? Thank you. Yeah. They took the suspect into custody. Their quick response and careful handling of the situation led to the successful rescue of the victim. Here's another video of a courageous woman escaping from the hands of her abductor, even as police exchange bullets with the kidnapper. Number four, body cam video shows a woman run from her kidnapper before a suspect killed. In a harrowing incident, a woman managed to escape her kidnapper, her ex-boyfriend, Melvin Porter, with the help of Houston police. The situation began with Porter's alleged kidnapping of one of her employees. She bravely offered to switch places with the hostage, leading to a tense journey. On August 23rd, Houston police responded to the incident, and body-worn camera footage revealed the dramatic events that unfolded. As Porter forced his ex-girlfriend to drive north, she seized an opportunity to escape. Pretending to need to use the restroom, the police swiftly moved in to intervene. Porter attempted to grab a gun during the encounter, prompting four officers to take action, resulting in his death. Uh, front passenger seat. Right. He's not moving right now. She, she's over here. She's, she's with the unit. Fortunately, the woman escaped unharmed and none of the officers firing their weapons were injured. The video shows the officers taking cover as they discharge their firearms to neutralize the threat. Come here! Come here! Come here! Hey! Hey! Despite the intense situation, the woman's escape and swift actions of the police ensured her safety. You're okay. You're all right. You're okay. You're okay. The incident left the woman's father relieved, but understandably shaken by the unexpected events. The next video shows the police successfully rescuing a kidnapped child. Number 5. Body cam shows police rescuing kidnapped child in Atlanta. The video captured a tense and emotional situation in Atlanta. 
as police try to rescue a child from his kidnapper. The police used a location device to look for the suspect and ended up finding him. The radio, they're tracking the car to South Gordon and hold on, let's stand by. Then they successfully apprehended him and rescued the kidnapped child. I got the car, Peoples and RDA. Yeah, information of GSD radio. Go, 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 go. Give me the air. Peoples northbound towards Oak Street. GSP is behind him. Show me your hands. Show me your hands. Get the out the door. Open the door. You trying to kill us? Oh my gosh, you trying to kill me? Why would y'all do that, man? Get out! Please, please don't get out! Don't beat me up, man. Listen, don't get on that door. Don't fight me, man. Get on the ground! Don't fight me! Stop! Don't fight me! He don't stop on the fight. He stop on the the video showcases the moment of relief and triumph as the officer safely retrieved the child and apprehended the suspect. Evidently, this was a high stakes situation, and the swift and decisive actions of the police ensured the child's safety. Here's another video of a rescue operation by the police. Number 6 dramatic rescue of a kidnapped girl caught on body cam video. The video starts with the officers locating the kidnapped girl and ordering the kidnapper to open the door. Open the door! Open it now! Break it. Open it! Hands! Let me see your hands! Step out here! Step out! The video captures the emotional intensity of the situation, and it's evident that the officers acted swiftly and efficiently to rescue the girl. Got her, we got her, we got her. We got her. Their actions demonstrate the dedication and commitment of law enforcement to protecting and ensuring the community's safety, especially in times of crisis. We need an EMT, get, get a cold med car. Yes, no, yes. No, no, don't worry about your clothes, don't worry about your clothes. We got a towel, we got a towel. Oh. Do we have it? Can we cover her up? Yeah. With something? Here, just Here you go, baby. Okay, baby. Can we get her out? Come here. Come on, sweetheart. You're okay? Yeah. You're safe? We got you. You're gonna be okay. We got her. Hold the door. Hey. Hey, let's go. Let's get her in here so she can sit down. Here's another video of police officers rescuing two kids kidnapped by a car thief. Number seven, that's not my dad. Cop rescues two kids from alleged kidnapper. Roll the window down. Why are you doing with the kids? What's going on? In this incident in Hillsborough County, Florida, on October 10th, an alleged kidnapper was caught on camera as Florida officers quickly rescued two young children. Deputy Jonathan Pazmino Alvarez was flagged down by a distressed father who reported that his children, aged four and eight, were taken when someone stole his truck. Just minutes later, the deputy spotted the stolen truck and pulled it over in a parking lot. Stop the truck, now! Pull into the parking lot! Roll the window down, bro. He's not your car? Step out of the car. He questioned the suspect, later identified as 37 year old Kevin Smith. Help me out. Okay? What do you mean, are you? Okay. Give me the car keys. 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 Despite the suspect's resistance, Deputy Alvarez successfully arrested him. Step out of the car. Stay here. I need to feel what's going Come here. Do you need your 94, 17, or you need your 4? Kevin Smith was charged with grand theft auto 
and two counts of felony kidnapping. Fortunately, the children weren't injured and were safely returned to their father. The clips in this video are brought to us by Inside Edition, Law and Crime Network, and Police Files. Check out the description below for a link to their channels and give them the credit they deserve. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.